Hey guys, welcome back to another episode new on Steam. Today we're playing a little bit of Ratchet & Clank Rift Apart. I've been looking forward to this game for a long time. Uh, I don't have a PlayStation, but I do have Steam, so it finally came out on this, so I'm super excited to go ahead and hop right in. I had to adjust some settings, that's why you see a save file up here. I didn't actually get much farther into the game. Uh, never got past the intro cutscene, so this is going to be a blind experience for me. So we're going to do Rebel Agent because it seems like it would be the only medium setting right here, so let's go ahead and take that. And I'm happy with the settings, so let's go ahead and start game. Members of the Resistance, report to your nearest intake facility immediately. We promise nothing nefarious will befall you. We promise. Report to the VIP section of your nearest intake facility for compulsory behavioral modification. It will be fun. Fun. Your suit seems to be working nicely. Blending right in. There is the assistant, and there is the infobot. Masterful work. Now get out of there and decrypt that thing. Where is the infobot? get home. I designed it to be one size fits all, so it should... Thank you! Don't you think it's weird to throw a celebration for us? I mean, we haven't done anything heroic in <laughs> years. What if everyone thinks we're washed up? <gasps> oh, what if we are washed up? <laughs> Luckily, we will not need to perform any heroics, <laughs> unless you count smiling and waving. <sighs> right. <laughs> <sighs> Give a big welcome to the Grand Marshals of our parade, Ratchet and Clay! <laughs> okay, so we can finally move. This game's absolutely gorgeous. It's like a uh, Pixar movie, but as a video game. So wow. let's go ahead and grab our wrench. Seen these guys in ages. Yeah, sorry for the intro. I had to turn on subtitles. Yes, folks, we have a momentous day in store for you. Starting with me. <laughs> and ending with a surprise gift from Clank to Ratchet. Oh dear. Must he tell the entire galaxy? Wait, a gift? For what? Oh, you will see. It is awaiting us at the front of the parade route. Well, we better get moving then. We all start on planet Bell. Which 
Okay, let's go ahead and destroy everything. Get some one of those arse screws. Okay, so I'm not talking, I'm just trying to listen to the dialogue a little bit. So we got jump, basic controls, X to attack, A, then wretch slam. Cool, so that's a quick ground pound. Okay, so uh, we're gonna wait for the platform to come up, so let's go ahead and take this baby. You gotta be the big bad. So left trigger and X to throw wretch. Cool, so we got a boomerang. Okay, so, uh, how do we shoot? Okay, so we hit that, and uh, we get ammo from ammo crates. So we're full ammo now, and we can shoot left trigger, just traditional uh, first-person, third-person shooter controls. Looks like we got some action going on now. So we don't have to zoom into the fire. Okay, so we got some party crashers here. Uh, do we got any more around here? Let's go ahead and grab some more ammo. So we don't need the wretch to uh, attack. So let's go ahead and hop onto the platform right here. Someone put a bounty on us? Boom! <laughs> Barely dodged that one. Oh, cool. This is not about we got sliding too. Uh, we, we have grinding. Jump over hazards. Okay. Some control so far. Ooh, ran into that. Luckily, it does no damage to us. Oh, dear. Activating Magna Boots. oh, cool. They're introducing a lot of mechanics in this game. Like, this is an awesome tutorial level. Super stoked to be playing this game right now. I'll beat the tether shot. Okay. There's a lot to this game. I would bet the blogs are behind this, or the Craigmites, or Doctor Nefarious. No way! Nefarious has been retired longer than we have. Right trigger the youth objective. Okay. The right uh, stick. So, doing some skydiving. Okay, so we got some more enemies right here, so let's go ahead and uh, take them. It's nice to be playing a triple-A game right now. I've been playing so many indie titles, like, that can't even come close to the production value of something like this. Then again, the state of... Ooh! That blew us up. And when they have 7 HP. Let's go ahead and shoot the barrels. So they don't backfire on us. So we got some health collected right now. Uh, I'm not sure what that does. Let's go ahead and shoot those barrels and take out those enemies. Oh! Did I just fall through the cart? Yeah, that didn't work out. So that seemed to be some sort of a uh, falling bug that we ran into. No issue. So, hold A to glide down. Watch out. Ooh, got nailed by that. Who's shooting us? Tons of health around. Gets hurt. Yeah, there's tons of goods around here. Really neat character and art direction in this game. So let's go ahead and pop everything. Excellent. Oh, can we dodge? No, there's no dodging in this game. It's not Dark Souls. So we level it up. So there's leveling up in this game. Ooh, barely missed us. So let's go ahead and get some more ammo. Pick up all the screws, get some HP. I'm guessing it's going to be really hard to die in the tutorial level. Got to watch our ammo usage since we don't have infinite ammo. Okay. Let's go ahead and pop this. Take out those. I got to remember to melee too. Okay, so we're gonna find anything fighting the dropship. 
So it looks like it has a health bar. It's either a health bar or that's my ammo. Kind of under the reticle. Okay. So it's definitely my ammo. Considering that our event seems to be under assault, I will cut to the chase. Ratchet, I do not know where I would be without you. You are my closest friend, my teammate, and you have given up a lot to... I have repaired the Dimensionator, so you can travel through dimensions and find your family. No, oh, how I... What? Dr. Nefarious, Ratchet and Clank! What a wonderful surprise! I didn't expect to see you here. Considering my goons were meant to annihilate you eight minutes ago. Oh, what do you want, Nefarious? Yes! Dr. Nefarious is such a party pooper. It looks like we're going for a ride. Oh, this is cool. Pursue Dr. Nefarious, okay. We have to get the Dimensionator away from Dr. Nefarious! Got to yes, dodge the uh, electric. Whatever he has planned, it cannot be good. Okay. Some action hero stuff right here. Let's go ahead and uh, take care of these enemies right here. Pop that one in the face. Kind of dodge everything. Kind of running low on ammo. So, are we shooting this? Or we Wait, kinda perhaps we can put Quark's pyrotechnics to use. Let's light him up. Okay, let's go ahead and get some more ammo. And we got some pyrotechnics, so uh, where do we launch that? Right here. There we go. Nefarious would try something like this. Don't beat yourself up. This will be just like old times. Come on. It looks like Nefarious landed somewhere near the train station. Oh, Mrs. Zircon. We should grab a weapon. Need a weapon? Mrs. Zircon has it all. Okay, so we go up here and buy. Use bolts to buy. Okay. So, uh, welcome to Mrs. Zircon's the one-stop shop to power up your arsenal. So, we got the uh, Shatter Bomb. We only can afford one thing. So, let's see. Feel the power of this Omniverse in the palm of your hand with explosive ball energy that tears apart baddies in reality. Or a single barrel destruction you will be when you blast through your enemies as double barreled plasma cannon. Double the firepower, double the fun. So, uh, I kind of like uh, this a little bit better. Something with a little bit more speed. So, let's go ahead and... Oh, we can uh, compare weapons with... Uh, using left stick and watch a preview with X.
Okay, that's pretty sweet. Let's go ahead and look at the Shatter Bomb now. Okay, we're gonna do the enforcer. So let's go ahead and hold A to buy. You have a good eye. Enjoy your purchases. Be sure to check out Mrs. Zarkon's shop regularly for new weapons. Okay, awesome. So it just automatically switches. Incoming. So hopefully this weapon's a little bit more powerful. I'm a fan of like shotguns and stuff like that in video games. Now there is a lot going on on the screen, so it's kind of overwhelming to a certain extent. Not much ammo in this gun. Oh, okay, explosive barrel. I gotta be careful with that. Getting shot from behind. He definitely needs some health pretty soon. So this weapon is pretty powerful. Uh, we got three health left. Uh, we gotta get some health right here. Okay. Barely got. Animations look so good, though. Uh, it's Mr. Archon still. Okay, we got another uh, enemy over there, so let's go ahead and dip, duck, dodge, and dive. Hold Y to select weapon. Okay. So we can switch between the Enforcer and the pistol. Okay. So we're out of ammo. Okay, where to go now? Uh, okay, the bridge is over here, so let's go ahead. Grab some bolts. Uh, get some health while we're at it. We're still trying to adjust to the game and how to plays, so hopefully we do pretty decent. Put down the dimensionator, nefarious. Put down the dimensionator. Yeah, right. Today you will see what losing feels like. Spoiler, it's exhausting. As soon as I figure out these stupid coordinates. Say goodbye. Ooh, that's not good. Whoa. What just happened? We may have a slight problem. The bridge is shot. There has to be another way across. Hmm. The rifts are reacting to the face quartz in your glove. Try pointing it at one of them. Okay. Hold LB to rift tether. That? Oh, that was cool. <laughs> Okay, let's go ahead and go over there. That's pretty neat. Never seen a mechanic like that before. So I'm not sure how groundbreaking this game is, but I'm guarantee there's going to be a lot of interesting mechanics. Kind of just side strafe and kind of shoot around. Uh, we need some more ammo. Uh, let's just go ahead and melee all these guys. Uh, we're taking some damage, though. I don't see any ammo crates around when I really need them. Oh, there's something going on. We got some dinosaurs now. Ah, uh, here's an ammo crate. And we got some enforcer ammo, so let's go back to the enforcer since it's pretty powerful. So screws are our main concern, it's currency, so we gotta keep up with it. Keep up with getting them. Ooh! I think one just bit me. Yeah, pushing a uh, half trigger is kind of difficult. So we're probably just gonna be doing double shots the entire time. Luckily, they only do one damage each. So we don't have to worry about like having 100 HP and enemies doing like 10 damage or something like that, or seven damage. Was that a Kraken? Or at least a very large octopus. Okay, let's get some more screws over here. And uh, yeah, we'll go down this hallway. 
This is definitely a theme park game. Nefarious is ship. We've got to find a way up there. The taxis leaving from that stand are driving right by him. Then we better not miss our ride. Okay. Hey, Let's go ahead and uh, hop up there. Rebuild the dimensionator. I have hobbies, and I know that finding the Lombaxes has always been important to you. I thought perhaps we could go together. Oh, that's really thoughtful. But I. Uh, why don't we get it back from the fairies first? So we can sprint in this game. Very nice. This guy has quite a bit of HP. Kind of look around real quickly. I don't see anything. Oh! Let's go ahead and melee. I keep forgetting there's no dodge. Let's go ahead and double jump. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and break some stuff real quickly. And let's see what's over here. I don't know if there's any secrets in this game or whatnot. I haven't played a Ratchet and Clank game in ages. Seems like I think the PS4. Doesn't sound like a long time ago, but it was. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and LB. Hook shut up. Okay, let's go ahead and get the last item. So we'll get the Shatter Bomb, just to have it. Not that we're going to use it that much, but let's go ahead and oh, switch weapons. Go back to the Enforcer, and we'll just use the Shatter Shot when uh, we get a when we run out of ammo with things, or if we get a horde of enemies. Uh, this might be a good thing for the uh, Scatter Bomb, Shatter Bomb. Oh, absolutely, wrecks them. Slow rate of fire. I kinda wish he like it's description. Okay. Go ahead and hop over here. Uh, let's go ahead and switch back to the Shatter Bomb. Seems pretty effective. Taking some hits, but nothing too bad. It's one-shotting them, so that's pretty good. But we have to actually nail them with it. We only get sh six shots with this, too. So we'll probably get more later. Okay. We gotta use the rift a little bit more. The range on this weapon is not that great. Leveled up again. Sweet. So we get more health now. So we're double health. So leveling has quite the uh, insane amount of benefits. Especially since we've got double health just for two levels. Nice work, Ratchet. Couldn't have done it without you, pal. So we gotta utilize these portals a little bit more in right. our combat. Now let's get to Nefarious. You two, these goons are useless. This is what I get for giving my assistant paid paternity. Quickly, we cannot let Nefarious overuse the Dimensionator. We must lower Ow. his defenses. Okay, so we can sprint and jump. Oh, Ow. Not working out for us. Let's go and get some health. Okay, let's go ahead and shoot him. Oh, we gotta hop over that. Okay. Ah, uh, doing a pretty crappy job on that. Uh, let's switch back to the burst pistol. There we go. Miss that again. We're pretty bad at dodging things. I wonder if that's gonna bite me later. Hopefully, there's some more health around. Okay, so we're getting plenty of burst ammo too. Toads are so unpleasant. Okay, so for anything close, we're gonna use our uh, shotgun. And then for distance, we'll use the uh, burst rifle. Yes, run from me. Okay, so we can double jump in the air. It's gonna be nice dodging tactics. Oh dear, he is targeting us. Okay, 
Luckily, there's a lot of telegraphing going on. Okay, so we need some more ammo crates. Uh, we could just melee these. So we've got some HP over there, too. So we'll grab that. Okay, so we got some ammo now. That thing seems like impossible to dodge, unless I'm not dodging correctly. Uh, can we get the scatter bomb? Oh yeah, that hits really hard. Got him. Probably should have used that when starting off. Okay, this is pretty wicked. Who? The dimensions are weakening considerably. Yeah. How bad is it? Huh? Well, it is certainly not good. Yeah, this game is super wild so far. Thoroughly happy I purchased this. <laughs> Did I do it? Oh, what is this? What's with all the neon? This is the part where you lose. The Dimensionator! Well, that's not good. Ratchet? Oh dear. My arm. And... No. The Dimensionator, it... What have I done? What have you done? Yeah. Who are you? Someone with a lot of questions. Let's go for a ride. Yeah. Wait, I have to find my friend. Ratchet and Clank rift apart. So that was a wild intro. Super fun. <laughs> so uh, looks like we get to play as the uh, chick now. I forgot her name already. So uh, what do we got here? Oh no, we're still Ratchet. Clank. Clank. What is this place? Games that uh, have dimensional travels always 
really trippy. So we gotta search for Clank now. Where are you, Clank? Maybe someone around here is seeing. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and pop a lot of these boxes and try to get as many screws as we can. Have any of you seen a little gray robot anywhere? Green eyes, red antenna, very charming. Sorry, all the charming robots I know have blue eyes. <laughs> okay. Let's go ahead and pop through. It looks like there's tons of rifts still going around too. So, no one seems confused at all by this transgression that's been going on. So, uh, yes, I'm going to be uh, doing a lot of breaking in this playthrough. Because that is the main currency for us. And breaking stuff is just how we get to upgrade our everything that we need to. Okay. So, people are starting to notice them now. So... Surprise there's not utter chaos going on right now. Please let there be good news behind here. <laughs> so we can go ahead and turn this too. So we've got another Welcome mechanic. To the nefarious city bazaar. Please remember to thank our marvelous emperor before, during, and after making your purchase. Emperor? Does that mean there are two nefariouses now? Clank first, nefarious later. Maybe he's in his bazaar. Okay. Looks like all the robots are kind of immune to me right now. Okay, so we still have all our guns too, which is pretty good. And we can glide down, but uh, let's go ahead and head up first and take a look. Just search every nook and cranny. So I gotta remember to uh, be able to use hover. So we don't have crank here, so we don't have the correct glide. But we do have our uh, gravity boots, rocket boots. So we can't go in there just yet. Wait a second. You forgot your order. We'll come right in. Miss Zircon will sell you weapons, but you gotta be less conspicuous, or the resistance will not last. The resistance? Sugar, Miss Zircon is still new to all of this espionage. Release the hostage. Quank, do I? that ship how can i get off planet it's a test only royal starships are allowed to leave anything else yeah. no. the phantom can help just follow the bait to club nefarious and you will find him club nefarious got it oh and nice work secret agent zircon oh, 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 oh. <gasps> this is so exciting what's club nefarious gonna sound like I can kind of hear it right now, too. So, uh, okay, we got the map. So we got level maps right now. As you explore the planet, collectibles and other points, interest will be revealed on your map. Highlight uh, and press A to pin it on the game HUD. Okay, so what do we got right here? Um, this is the search for the factory that's optional. Uh, still trying to get... Um, we've got optional objectives here. So, looks like everything that's highlighted in purple is areas that we've explored. So this will give us good opportunity to kind of a, this is kind of a collect-a-thon type of game. You Let's see if you have any weapons. To every fight? Mr. Fun Guy is the weapon for you. Let's see what this has. The only weapon who has destroyed little Zircon's enemies and performed at his last birthday party. Mr. Fun Guy. Just throw him out and he will strike your enemies so hard they will have to deal with his enemies. Okay, so this is pretty cool. So it's kind of like a turret-based weapon, uh, but we can't afford it. 
Uh, we can't afford any of this stuff. Gonna be a doozy. But we can refill our ammo and stuff, so uh, we'll go ahead and do that here. So there's the optional objective above us. The sooner I find Club Nefarious and this Phantom, the sooner I can get to Clank. Okay, I still don't know how to open that. Uh, looks like the optional objective is above us, so we're gonna go ahead and try to figure out how to get up. Oh, okay, cool. So we got gravity boots, so this will get us up here. Sounds useful. Could be worth a look. Okay, so we're looking for a resistance spy bot up here. Apparently. Uh, let's open up the map again. Uh, this would be another optional objective. Uh, where are we? Are we the yellow uh, arrows? I'm assuming that's us. Okay. So let's go ahead and just head randomly this direction. Uh, let's open up the map and select this. There we go. I'm on my way, Clank. I just need to find this phantom guy first. So in this kind of playthrough, we're kind of just going to go randomly into whatever direction we feel like at the time. Nothing too particular. Not focused just on the main mission or anything. Whatever side collectibles that we kind of collect, uh, we kind of collect. So this game about 4S is about kind of exploring also. Oh, got some more robots. We almost have enough uh, to afford that turret. So a rare tanium. Not sure what that is just yet. I better head to the loading platform fast. So we got double jumps and stuff too. Pretty cool. Um. So there seems this map seems to be pretty huge in general. So let's go ahead and use the red to go this direction now, and we'll open this. Absolutely. I, it's been a while since I played a game with so much dialogue too, which is pretty nice because you kind of a break from talking. <laughs> so we'll go ahead and hop up here and use everything as kind of a platforming section. So this better lead to a pretty decent secret, hopefully. Controls are really tight, so that's really nice. Uh, good change of pace. Okay, let's go ahead and get some more health. Looks like we're full health already, so we'll go ahead and hop up here. And what do we got over here? Some robots to kill. Excellent. Spybot must have Omega level secrets inside of it or something if everyone's going after it. Okay, this is a really big facility. Must be just ahead. Okay. Let's not get stuck anywhere. Uh, let's go ahead and look around what we got here. Uh, nothing really to break, but uh, we got some boxes we can kind of hop on top of. I'm not sure that was the way we're supposed to go. Ooh, I think that's some HP. So far, the enemies are pretty easy to destroy. Okay, uh, we need another rift or something. So we're down here. So we got some rare tainer. I'm not sure what this is used for just yet. But we'll figure out. Oh, got some enemies. Who has a long range weapon? Looks like we killed them. 
Okay, let's go ahead and switch weapons to uh, the Enforcer. Kind of hover across. Oh! Okay, so we fell down. We gotta take him out at ranged. Uh, let's go ahead and switch to the Shatter Bomb. And we'll launch it right at there. Should take them both out. One's still alive. Got it. So, uh, we should be able to kind of hover across and... Okay, we'll get some more ammo too. Let's go get some more HP while we're at it. Should be able just to hover across. And I don't see a rift. So... And grab onto the ledge. There we go. That's pretty cool. We got ledge grabs too. So let's go back to our pistol since it's full ammo. Those beams are a little hard to dodge, but manageable. To be honest, there is a lot going on the screen. Uh, it's just something in my eyes got to get used to. There's a lot of graphics. Oh, what is that? Let's go ahead and switch to the Enforcer. Do more damage to that. Seems like uh, they do decent damage to the, uh, the, the melee enemies. Okay, let's go ahead and switch to the Shatter Bomb. Seems to be doing decent damage. I'm using the Shatter Bomb a lot more than I anticipated I would. Okay, so we get a tons of loot from this. Tons of screws. Okay, let's pop this last enemy. And we got the spy bot. Excellent. You found a resistance spy bot. Each one contains secret intel you can listen to. They also contain encoded weapons research. Find them all and Mr. Archon will craft you the ultimate weapon. Sweet. Uh, armor. You found armor pod. These grant permanent boosts whether you equip them or not. Collect more completing pocket dimensions, exploring pallets, and completing optional content. Okay. So, um, what can we equip? You can change your appearance by pressing A and equip armor. Press X to customize equipped armor color. Okay. So, we got hacker. Rebellion. That's cool. Android. That's some Guardians of the Galaxy stuff right here. <laughs> Imperial. Uh, scavenger. Hollow Flux. That looks pretty cool. Commando suit. And Marauder. And Clank. Uh, that's cute. And Quest. Uh, Quest. I like Quest. It seems to be the uh, the most basic. Um, uh, we can also change colors, but I'm not really concentrating on that right now. Okay, so uh, we got weapons over here. We got gadgets. Uh, collectibles. Let's go ahead and... Go to this right here and play this. City. It has been ten years since Carson Five fell, and this rotten place arose out of the ashes like a blighted temple. The Emperor promised peace and order, but all Ms. Zircon got was oppression and slightly cheaper consumer electronics. Travel to other worlds has been heavily restricted, along with civil liberties and public crying. But with all the bleakness and despair and hideous architecture, there is one grace note. This is where the resistance was born. Sweet. Okay. So now we're going ahead and finish sliding down and see where it takes us. Okay. So let's go ahead and check out our map. Looks like we explored everything here. Um... So these are just a lot of the collectibles and stuff like that. Um, we're probably not going to focus too much on that stuff, stuff right there. But just whatever comes up. I think we can afford uh, the weapon now, the turret weapon. So we're going to go ahead and head down that way. And we're going to go ahead and purchase Mr. Fungi. Okay, we're gonna go back to the burst pistol, and we're gonna refill our ammo too. 
so that refer refills all our ammo and our weapons have levels on them very nice so they probably get more and more powerful more attachments more things uh let me go ahead and take a look at weapons real quickly so we can remap weapon okay that's cool uh it doesn't really tell us what levels do to it so far and okay that seems to be it so i'm gonna end the episode for now and we'll finish up the city the next episode so if you like this episode please leave a like and subscribe and i'll catch you next time thank you